Hello everyone, welcome to our new Easy Project webinar. My name is Jan and I'm Integration Specialist in Easy Software. And today I'll show you how import data to Easy Project and integration possibilities through our REST API interface or Zapier platform. So first, uh, how to import your data in Easy Project? We support a uh, standardized imports for projects and tasks. Uh, you can see on my screen the bottom import data on the left sidebar. When I click on it, I can see four types of import from Excel sheet, from Jira application, for MS project and or for, from Asana. Every application has all help article when you can find how to export data uh, from this application and of course there is a link to the conversation of this application how to export projects and tasks uh, i'll show you how to import project and tasks uh, from excel sheet first you have to download sample data through this link so i open the sheet and for our demonstration uh, just delete okay sorry delete these rows and use only a few rows so there is a field for the name of the project field of the name for task of these projects due date assignee uh, priority status tracker tracker means task type and description so if I write there, for webinar, my test task, so they could be same, normal task, that's fine. I save it, and then I click choose the file and choose the file which I downloaded before and click to import it can take a while uh, but after importing data, you can see the import report where you can see the project and task uh, which was uh, imported. You can see the task statuses and priorities and types which was imported or it could be skipped uh, when these statuses, priorities or task types is already exist. Uh, you can find import the data of course in your administration in this section is the imports there is a standardized imports of course there is a similar dashboard and project templates imports uh, these templates you can find in our 
community portal. So if you uh, watch our previous webinar about community, uh, you can find how to download these dashboards and projects, templates, and how to import it to Easy Project. Uh, but today we are going to talking only about data and about integration. Of course, there is a custom imports possibilities uh, via XML and CSV uh, file, but it's only for trained stuff only because you have to be scalped about data mapping of the fields for each entity. So it's recommended to contact our support and they help you with these custom imports. So it's all about the data imports. And now we are going to talk about uh, integration. So uh, Easy Project has a complex API interface, application programming interface uh, that enables easy integration with uh, other system through the REST API and uh, provides operation like read, create, edit, and delete with uh, almost all type of entities in easy project as is tasks, projects, project templates, time entries, users, of course, contacts, and CRMs. So, uh, if you are technical skilled or uh, you have some developer team in your company, you can uh, develop your own microservice and connect API of your system with API of Easy Project. Uh, through this link, you find full documentation about API endpoints, how to create data, how to update, and how to retrieve data uh, with uh, all sample data and all information what you need. Uh, of course, it's possible to create custom integration for you. So do not hesitate and send us request for consultation. We analyze your needs, um, prepare a solution for you, quotation, and we can uh, create this microservice uh, for you. So just click on choose a date and fill this form and send us a request and we'll contact you. Um, so final, I think what I would like to show you is a Zapier integration, uh, what is the most sophisticated solution for integration, I'll show you a small presentation. So what is Zapier? Zapier is integration platform, middleware, connecting uh, REST APIs of more than 1,000 most used apps and allow transferring data from one app to another. So Easily, you can set up your automated integration work workflow, calls up, and how Zapier apps works. Every application developed on Zapier has uh, triggers, searches, and action events. It's building blocks that power the integration called Zap. Triggers watch uh, for events in application and starts the sequence of searches and actions. So the trigger transferring data from application to the Zapier. Uh, and then there is a searches. They can look up existing data in 
application and in the end of the workflow is action which creates new items to application so you can here you can see the sample workflow example uh, integration toggle application and easy project uh, so in the toggle there is a setup a trigger a new time entry so when in toggle is created time entry it's triggered to zapier and zapier uh, start action create time entry which create new type entry to easy project so uh, how to simply create zap it's only four steps or sorry five steps so first of all we have to choose the application and the trigger second you have to connect your account to the zapier uh, allow connect with your application and check if there is something new uh, next you have to choose the application for action which will be uh, kick off by the trigger and of course you have to connect this application to zapier allow zapier to create data to this application finally you turn on this zap and you have automate integration workflow done uh, so now i'll i'll show you some demonstration how to create the zap and there are uh, solution how to self integrate it because is a project is public on zapier so uh, if you create account on zapier to create your own integration you can find easy project there and you can create your own integration today easy project has developed on zapier these triggers which can trigger a new data from easy project uh, is the tasks projects and time entries and uh, we have developed one search event for finding the project and uh, if you're almost focused on action because you want to creating data from another systems to application easy project so there are actions like create project create tasks create time entry uh, you are able to update the task and of course there are uh, create action for project budgets so you can connect your finances to project budget and create project expenses or project incomes of course Zapier allows templates there is a predefined application uh, for trigger and application for action and you can easily create your own zap with these templates or you can create your zap from the sketch and i show you right now for instance we have use case that we are using some to do application and you want to see it in this to the application uh, our new task which is created in easy project so for instance i use easy project for triggering triggering new tasks and application to do is for creating new to do's from these tasks so i when i am connect when i, I log it to zapier i clicked make new zap
first of all i need to choose easy project application then i find the trigger so i need trigger new task i choose new task save and connect then i have to uh, connect my account to zapier i have a lot of connections there but i show you how to connect new one so i click to connect and i need to fill full domain of my application and find the api key of my account to this application so i can use uh, this demo where i copy the full domain and then i find my api key uh, there is a little hint so if you click on your profile and click to edit there you can find your epic key so i click my profile edit and yes there is a epic key so i copy it Yes, and there is a new connection. I tested yeah, success, it works great. So then save and continue. I can choose the project uh, where I want to trigger the new task. So I'll choose the yeah, task. Uh, which we are imported in the first part of our webinar. Click to continue. And there must be some test for uh, trigger sample data. Test was successful. I can see the sample data triggered so there is a, of course my test task from the uh, imported part of our webinar i click to continue there i find to do is okay i want to create a task and to do is Save and continue. Of course, I have prepared some uh, connected account, but I can connect a new one. Just, so just I use this one and only test it. Yeah, it's successful. I set the connect. And here is the magic because I can uh, assign triggered uh, data to this form for action. So I just uh, choose the project in to do is so i choose the personal and then i can uh, assign the triggered field so title will be uh, the subject of easy project task and note could be description and there are uh, of course some optional fields but for our demonstration it's it's fine so i can click continue and i finish the testing of all integration so i send the test to todoist tasks uh, test is uh, great so when i log in to my Todoist application and click to personal project. Here you can see uh, created my ta test task from Easy Project. 
So I finish the integration and final step is the name, create the name of your ZAP test and I turn it on. So ZAP is ready and every five minutes the ZAP uh, will check if uh, there is a, some new task in Easy Project and if it is, uh, Zapier create a new task in Todoist. I can see it in my dashboard. Yeah, so there is a Zap and uh, it's turned on. So it's the simple way how to create integration uh, with most used uh, web application. like this one so you can search your application uh, what you use in your company and you can connect it with easy project uh, all information about Zapier integration you can also find in our website product and Zapier integration and also uh, you can find there uh, Zapier templates, so you are able to self-integrate it, and of course, uh, we are here to help you to implement this integration by our Easy Team. So, uh, if you want, uh, send us a request. Uh, we analyze your needs and prepare some apps for you testing ZAPs and uh, you can use it uh, by created by our team. Of course, the Zapier integration is a middleware platform, so there is a, some small fee uh, for the transferring data. So we have to buy uh, some plan for, for transferring data. If you are if you are uh, locked to Zapier, uh, you can choose your plan, or if you want to implement it from us, you can buy the plan for from us. So, of course, there is a Zapier request form, so you can uh, write us a request and write. Uh, your integration needs and we contact you. So uh, it's all from me. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, write us. Uh, we are here for you and we'll help you with everything. So have a nice day and we'll see you on our next webinar. Thank you so much and bye.